So, balls of the feet, walk your feet in as close as you possibly can. Make sure that the circle is not directly on the knee joint, but slightly above it. So a little bit closer towards your pubic bone. Again, you're on your toes. You have your spine. You're on your toes though. Place your toes on. Lift your heels up high. Start by squeezing the circle a little bit using your glutes. Put your tailbone under, lift your lower back, middle back and upper back all the way up towards the ceiling. And then exhale, slowly articulate the spine back down. And again, squeeze the circle and lift all the way up, 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 up. And then slowly articulate back down. Two more, inhale, curl and lift up. Up, 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 up. That's it. Exhale, slowly articulate down. One more, inhale, curl and lift up and stay up. Squeeze that circle a little bit tighter using your inner thighs and glutes. Lower your heels, lift your heels, lower and lift. Last four and three and two, squeeze tight with the inner thighs. And one, maintain that squeeze and hold. Squeeze the circle in an inch and out an inch. In an inch and out an inch. In an inch and out an inch. Last five. And four. Lift those heels higher, team. Three. And two. And one, slowly come down from your upper back, middle back, and your lower back. Keep the circle where it is. Bring your legs to tabletop position. Option to put your headrest back up if you like it in the up position once the legs are in tabletop. Okay? Squeeze the circle nice and tight. Hands stay down by your sides. Exhale, lift the head and chest up. Inhale, lower your head and chest down. Exhale, lift the head and chest up. Squeeze that circle more. Inhale, back down. One more time. Exhale, lift up. Hold it up here. Hold it. Pump the arms up and down for the 100. Breathe into your nose and out through your mouth. Breathe into your nose and out through your mouth. Three more. Into your nose, out through your mouth. Into your nose, eyes to belly, out through your mouth. Last one. Into your nose and out through your mouth. And hold it here. Hands go behind your head. For support, elbows are pulling in two different directions. Squeeze that circle nice and tight. And can you get your heels together? Yeah. And then exhale, push the legs out over the foot bar. Oh my gosh. And bend the knees. And push out. This is your double leg stretch. And bend the knees. And push. If you can keep the heels together, go for it. Bend the knees. And push. And bend. Last three. Push. And bend. I know who's finding that core. Push. And bend. Last one. Heels if you can. Push. Hold it. Separate the legs once again. Bring the legs up towards the ceiling now. Squeeze that circle tight. Double leg, lower lift. Lower your legs down, two, three. Lift up. Straight legs if it's accessible. Down, two, three, and up. Elbows are still wide, team. Down, two, three, and up. Last two. Down, two, three, and up. Last one, wide elbows, down, two, three, and up. Bend the knees, rest. Shake it up. Oh, shake it up, shake it up, shake it up. <laughs> All right, place your feet in between the circle at this time. Okay, and have it just above your ankles. Just above your ankles as you did previously for your bridging series, okay? All right, start with your knees bent. All right, exhale, lift the head and chest up. Find tabletop position with your legs. Remember the padded part is just above the ankle joint. Hands go behind your head for support here. We'll do a combination move here. So hands behind the head. Push the legs out over the foot bar. Lift the legs up towards the ceiling. Knees to chest, push out. Lift the legs up, bend the knees and push. Up. Get the fan. Bend the knees, yep. And push, keep going. Up, bend the knees, and push, and up. Bend the knees, and push. One more time, up, 
Bend the knees and push, keep the legs extended over the foot bar. Hold that position. Open the legs out wide and close. Open, close, open, close, open, close. Legs are straight. Open, close, open, close, open, close. Ideally, the circle is here. Okay, that's fine. Open, close, open, close, open, close, open, close. Open, close. Yep. There you go. Five, four, three, two, one. Lay your head down, bend your knees. Oh like you're taking your baby aggressions out. I know. <laughs> I have this burst energy. I can tell. <laughs> I feel like my old self a little bit. <laughs> All right. Keep the circle where it is, though. Okay. Hands go underneath your butt. Okay. All right. Bring your legs up towards the ceiling. Hands underneath your glutes, aka your butt, wherever you want to word it. All right. Push out into the circle a little bit more. Okay. You're gonna do like a little wave side to side. So sway your legs toward the left and center and right and center, left and center. Keep your legs straight, right and center. The goal is to keep your hips pressing into the carriage. So only like one hip lifts off, but the other one stays still. That's it. One more each way and then meet me in the middle. Good, hold the legs up where you have them. Hands come up towards the ceiling. Legs are as straight as you possibly can have them. Take your left hand, reach for your right foot, and then switch, and switch. Try to touch your foot, not your ankle, your foot. That's it. Yeah, we're gonna get deep into those abs today. Last eight, and seven, six, you got it. Five, almost there. Four, come on, push it. Three, two, one. Reach up to one side, hold it, and you pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Four, three, two, one. Switch, pulse, 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 pulse. Four, three, two, one, and down. Oh, thank you. You rest. Okay, grab the circle with your hands. We're just gonna do our single leg stretch, a little variation, and then we'll move on from abs. That sound good? Okay. <laughs> All right. And if anybody needs to take a quick stretch, now's a good time. You wanna stretch out your hamstrings, stretch out anything, just go ahead and take, go ahead and take that little time to stretch. Because that was pretty intense, and you maybe want some water before we move on, okay? A warning? No, all right. <laughs> no, just, just giving your body time to recuperate. All right, hold onto the circle with your hands at this time. All right, once you feel like you got all stretched out. All right, find tabletop position with your legs. Now remember, the heel of your hand, right, the part just above your wrist, is what's on the padded part of the circle. I don't want to do that because it makes it really Yeah. So here. And your fingers are up. There you go. And you're squeezing from this part of your hand. That's it. All right. Squeeze that circle. Exhale. Lift your head and chest up. Okay. Hold that position. Extend your right leg over the foot bar. And switch. And switch. That's it. Switch. And switch. Point your toes. Four. Three. Two. One. Now. Have the knees bent. Keep your head and chest up. It feels okay for you. Squeeze that circle. Bend the elbows back towards the headrest and extend both legs over the foot bar. Mm -hmm. Then straighten the arms. Bend the knees. Arms go back. Straighten the legs and bend. That's it. It's the double leg stretch with a tricep. No, you're fine. With a tricep kickback. So you want to have your arms go back near the headrest each time. Okay, that's it. Try to keep your head and chest up if it feels okay. Otherwise, put your head down. There's no shame in your game. Last three. And two. And one, keep your legs extended and hold and the arms should be back towards the mirror with the elbows bent. Squeeze that circle in and out, in and out, in and out. I'm prepping for this arm work that's coming. In and out, in and out. Elbows bent back a little bit more so elbows should be up here. Yes, now bend. That's it. Now you feel more triceps. Four. Yeah, you're welcome. Three, two, 
One, and you rest. Good, shake it out. All right, we now have crisscross. So arms come up towards the ceiling, okay? Once again, heel of the hand is on. All right, you will then find tabletop position with your legs. Exhale, lift the head and chest up. Rotate your torso towards the right and hold it here, okay? Extend your left leg over the foot bar, hold that position. Lift your left leg up towards the ceiling and back down. Just your left leg, lift up and down. Now can you squeeze the circle in and out as you're doing? Lift up and back down. Lift up and back down. Head can go down if you need to. That's it, last three. Remember, squeeze that circle in and out each time. Two, and one, and rest before we go to the other side, okay? Arms come back up towards the ceiling. Just got a rest? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that was your rest. Lift back up, rotate your torso to the other side here. Extend your right leg and then lift it up and down. Up and down, mm -hmm. lift up higher. That's it, squeeze that circle in and out. Really helps to in squeeze the circle. Yeah, it does. In and out helps you get more into the abs. Up and down with your leg, not in and out. So up towards the ceiling and down. That's it. Three. Come on. And two. And one. And relax. Good. Gee, I thought you'd be easy because this was a new person in class. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I get this burst of energy. All right, go ahead. <laughs> and come off of your reformer. You just need one blue spring. Okay. All right, you'll still need your circle. All right. You will then sit up against your shoulder blocks. Feet will face the center of the room. Mm -hmm. If your lower back feels a little tight, grab your yoga block and put a little prop. Put it up underneath your butt if your lower back feels tight. The prop does make a difference if you feel a little kinky. Okay? All right, then reach for your small loops and then hold on to your circle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ideally, the legs are straight and the back of the knees are pressing into the carriage. Okay. All right, find that right position for you. All right, just make sure you're nice and even. Right, again, you're holding on to the circle. Fingertips are out long, sit up nice and tall. From here, start with the elbows back, and then exhale, push the arms forward. Inhale, bring the arms back, sit up taller. Exhale, push forward, inhale back. That's it, remember the heel of your hand is still what's on the circle. That's it, so will you please refine that position? Yes, the heel of the hand is still on the circle. That never changes when you hold it. Last four, and three, two, and one, push the arms forward and hold. Exhale, squeeze the circle in and out. In and out, sit up a little bit taller. In and out, in and out. Last five. And four, come on. Three, two, one. Keep the arms extended and hold. Try to have your elbows inside of the straps. Then bring your arms up two inches and back down. Bring it up two inches and back down. Now we're getting the tops of the shoulders, the delts. Up two inches and down. Sit up a little bit taller if you can. Last four. You can always sit cross legged too if that works better for your body. Three. Mm -hmm. And two. Yep, cross legged is fine. And one. Hold it up here. Hold it. Hold it. Now squeeze the circle in and out. In and out. In and out. In and out. Sit up taller. Three. Two, and one, bring it back down, slide the elbows in, take a quick moment to rest, we do a combination move. We will then exhale, push the arms forward, ready? Oh. Inhale, that was, that was it. That was, like a second. that was it, yeah. <laughs> bring the arms up, mm -hmm. bring them down, bend the elbows, bring it in. Push out, lift up, come down, pull it in. Push out, lift up and down, Bring it in, three more, push out, lift up, and down, pull it in, last two, and push, and lift, and down, and in, one more, and push, and lift, and down, 
Bring it in, separate the legs outside of the reformer at this time, okay? Go ahead, put your straps away. You won't be able to do it without. Hold on to your circle. Mm -hmm. Have your circle go behind your back. Mm -hmm. So hold on to it with, each, with, with your hands if you can. And have it away from the shoulder box. Feet flat onto the floor. Carriage can be out a little bit, but what you're gonna do now is you're just gonna exhale, fold, forward, inhale, come up. That's it. Exhale, nose dive forward. Shouldn't really be touching the head, the uh, headrest at all, and come up. That's it. And fold, and reach. Still stay in place. Oh, okay. That never changes. Okay. There you go. It's a little stretch here. Last three. Mm -hmm. And two. And one, fold down and hold that position here. Mm -hmm. Hold it. If you can, I'm just going to readjust it a little bit for you. Okay? All right? See if you can keep the fingers straight so that way the heel of the hand is touching. And then squeeze the circle in and out. It would help. It's, 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 it's going to help. <laughs> all right, now three. It's deep on the shoulders. Two, one, and then come all the way up. Look ahead and place the circle away. I know. Okay. Reach down. Add on a red. Lay onto your back from feet and strap. 